school in Tacoma is one of the places Elijah is most comfortable. Ask him much. He's very close with his teacher, Ruthie Altos. They've known each other for three years. I've seen him grow so much. I've seen his vocabulary grow. I've seen him mature. Um, and I feel really privileged to work with Elijah. She works very closely with him and understands him. He's funny and he's sweet and he's polite. Um, he's a really hard worker and he's somebody that even though trust doesn't come super easily to him, um, when you have it, you know, then he's your guy. Elijah is 13 and benefits from short work sessions with predictable breaks and schedules. Some of his favorite things are pizza, chocolate milk, listening to music, and watching Disney movies. Tops for Elijah are The Lion King, Pocahontas, and Mickey Mouse. Elijah works with an occupational and speech therapist. He's gaining tools to help him better communicate. Elijah needs a patient, caring family dedicated to helping him succeed. I think Elijah needs somebody who appreciates him and accepts him for being him. Um, someone who's going to meet him where he's at. He's somebody who's been through a lot more than most of us ever will go through um, and has a harder time communicating that. So people who are going to be patient with him and love him for who he is, however he's being in that moment and just make him feel safe. If you are that special family, Elijah's social worker wants to hear from you. With Wednesday's Child, I'm Robin Nance, KXLY 4 News.